New York City, Islamic State attack plot is revealed. A jihadist plot to attack New York City including Times Square and the subway system was foiled with the help of an undercover FBI agent, officials say. One man in the U.S. and two others in Pakistan and the Philippines are under arrest and face charges of plotting the attacks which they hope to carry out in the name of the Islamic State group. One of the suspects allegedly said he wanted to create the next 9-11. The trio allegedly used chat apps to plan their attack. It was prevented last year with the help of an undercover FBI agent, posing as an IS supporter, who communicated with the three plotters. Details of the alleged plot were released on Friday as prosecutors revealed the charges. Police on Friday announced charges against Abdul Rahman Albanis A. 19, a Canadian citizen detained in New York, Tel Yoon, also 19, a U.S. citizen based in Pakistan and Russell Salak, 37, from the Philippines. Albanis A. was arrested in May 2016 and pleaded guilty last October to seven terror-related charges. He is awaiting his sentence. Haroon was arrested in Pakistan in September 2016, while Salik was arrested in the Philippines the following April. Both men are due to be extradited to the U.S. The planned attacks included detonating bombs in Times Square and the New York City subway system and shooting civilians at specific concert venues, a Department of Justice statement said. The trio helped to carry out the attacks during the Muslim holy fasting month of Ramadan in 2016, inspired by an attack the previous year on the Budokan Concert Hall in Paris and by an attack on the Metro in Belgium. Abdul Rahman Albanis Aid is alleged to have sent the undercover FBI agent an image of Times Square, saying that we seriously need a car bomb to attack it. He allegedly wanted to create the next 9-11. Telha Haryun is alleged to have told the agent that the subway would be a perfect target, and that suicide vests could be detonated after their ammunition was used up. Russell Salak, known as the doctor, he is accused of sending approximately $423 to finance the attacks with the promise to supply more cash. New York was the target of the September 11, 2001 attacks that killed nearly 3,000 people and led to President George W. Bush's war on terror, which included the invasions of Afghanistan and Iraq.